What is up YouTube? It's your boy Johnny A. I'm back at you guys with another video today. Hope you guys are all doing good on this Saturday. I know I haven't made a video in like the last week or so. Um, honestly, I know you guys saw the title of the video. And yeah, it's true. I did take out money out of the Acorns portfolio. Uh, I wanted to be real transparent with you guys. Um, and I wanted to just be real honest about what I did. Uh, I had some money that I've been meaning to take out for a while now. I've been thinking about it for weeks. And I just had to pay off my car. I just had to get out of that debt that I had uh, with that car payment. Honestly, I was just not happy paying paying that every single month. On top of that, I was paying interest. And I just told, told myself, listen, I got to get out of this debt. I feel like it was just holding me back from where I really wanted to put my money into. Um, so, yeah, guys, I took out a good amount. It wasn't, trust me, it was, a, it was pretty heartbreaking for me to take the money out because I really didn't want to touch the Acorns account. But I had to, guys. I really just had to get this debt debt out of the way, this car payment out of the way. Um, you know, things, materialistic things aren't pleasurable at all. It's just like a temporary feeling you get uh, for a certain amount of time. And then once you think about it, it's, it's just something that's holding you back when you have debt in your hands and you got to pay all this money to these car dealers uh, credit card, banks. I mean, having debt is not fun, guys. And I felt like that was just kind of holding me back to what I really wanted to do when it came to my finances. So I had to take out money out of the Acorns portfolio. Um, as you guys can see here, I withdrew $17,000 out of the Acorns account. Um, unfortunately, I know this is going to kind of set me back from dividends and, uh, long-term investment a bit but i know now that i'm trying to get out of debt with this money that i took out um i should be a little bit more better i should be better when it comes to getting paid every 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 two weeks every week whatever the case may be i can now put probably a little more money into the acorns and other things i'm trying to do in my life so you can see right now 34k is where the core account is it says here it's up eight thousand all time I don't know if that's going to fluctuate now that I took out the money. Um, but here are my investments. Uh, I think the, you can see here the only thing in red is the international company stocks. Uh, the breakdown here is 32,000 in stocks, 1,600 in Bitcoin ETF. So uh, my shares have gone down now that I took money out. You can see the Bitcoin strategy. I had this at 215, now at 110. The VOO stocks are at 47 shares. Medium company stocks, 13. Small company stocks, 17. International company stocks at 156. So obviously I lost a lot of shares taking money out of the core uh, the core account. But guys, like I said, it just felt like I some, something I had to do and something that was holding me back from what, I, what, I, what I'm trying to accomplish with my life. So um, yeah, guys, that's, that's basically what has what i've been doing the last week or so um i haven't really even been putting more money in there you guys can see here um i had a one-time investment earlier in the week a roundup investment i did receive the bito dividend 90 dollars and 11 cents um so you know little things like that you know still dollar cost averaging little amounts whenever i can so 34k still not a bad amount to have in there um the latest account is at three thousand two hundred and twenty seven dollars up up three hundred and thirty four dollars all time so that's where i'm at with the latest account and um that's basically where i'm at right now in this stage with my investment portfolio with acorns um you know, I'm going to try to see if I could put more money in now that I don't have any debt. Uh, but I'm trying to see if I could save, put more money in my savings account to have my emergency fund a little bit more at hand. I uh, have, have more money in debt right now um, and see where I could go on here on out for, with my Acorns portfolio. So 
yeah guys uh i just wanted to update you guys on where it's at on what i what i did uh i want to be real with y'all it wasn't a easy decision it was something i've been like i said been thinking about it for weeks even months uh but now that i finally did it i'm gonna try to uh be a little bit more uh smart make wiser decisions where my money should be going and trying to get uh, more assets to make me more money in the long term. So, uh, yeah, guys, 37K, where the Acorns portfolio is at. If you're new to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button to follow me on my investment saving journey, saving money journey as well. And I appreciate all of you guys for just tuning in and just sticking with me through the ups and downs. Obviously, the stock market has its ups and downs. You guys have been seeing it for the last two, three, four, five years that I've been making videos so i appreciate all your support guys i will see you guys on the next video peace